The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Real Madrid. They face Atletico Madrid and it's coming your way next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid, again, real chance. Now keep on getting bent gloves on the ball. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal starts with Fernand Mendy in the fullback positions. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. Well, what a chance to take the lead. And doesn't he know it? But will they get a better one than that? Here are the starters for Atletico. Jan Oblak gets the nod in goal. Stefan Savic plays with Jose Maria Jimenez in the center of defense. Rodrigo de Paul starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And in attack today, Memphis Depay starts alongside Antoine Griezmann. A tremendous block. taking the corner and dealt with it nicely Griezmann will be breathing a sigh of relief ball one clear to see who got the last touch so a throw in it'll be Eduardo Camavinga going well Vinicius. Oh, he looks threatening. Mbappe! And it was there for them to take the lead so early on here. Well, they've certainly started brightly, and that should have been the opening goal, no doubt about that. Vinicius Junior is the sort of player who wears his heart on his sleeve. We can tell that he enjoys playing this great game. What do you expect to see from him? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders. He's got that ability to run with the ball into open space. He can pick out a pass. He can wriggle out of tight situations. He's the most creative player on the field today. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, we can get them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? Well, not every player is capable of that sort of thing. Full marks for trying. Shame about the execution. possession in a good area of the pitch okay and the pie on the ball Rodrigo here's Valverde Bellingham might work out they could be for Mbappe
Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. It's just a change of pace. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so quickly. It's a great goal. Playing again. This is a going to play, that's for sure. Back underway. 1 0 it is. Tremendous intuition to win a goal. Rodrigo. Looking promising. Chance to finish. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. Kamavinga. Given away by Real Madrid. Jimenez. Okay with it. That's been me quite Savage. It's with Hermoso. Marcos Llorente. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Mbappe. Vinicius Junior. Well, there's the pullback. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Getting in there to intercept. And nearing the half time interval, Real Madrid hold the edge here. Stuart, how about your assessment of what you've seen from them in the first 45? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Marcos Llorente. Defoe. Moving the ball nicely in search of an equaliser. Regaining possession. Jimenez. Rodrigo de Paul. Coque. It's with Hermoso. There will be one minute added on at the end. Valverde. And nothing comes of that attack. And there we have it, the first half comes to an end here at the San Siro. again, Real have the lead but they won't be taking anything for granted Nepal simply making attacking inroads at Levico Madrid Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final What next in the drama? Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. The injury will mean a stoppage. The referee going down that road, so treatment can be administered now. 
Well, sensible refereeing, you might say. Now he goes back and hands out the yellow card, Stuart. Yeah, that's very good. He let the play continue and then came back for the earlier challenge. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. And they'll get things going again with a drop ball. Carvajal. Eder Militao. Camavinga. Here's Mbappe. Van Verde. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. It is an Atletico substitution. Someone get on the end of this. And the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happens. What can Real do from this position? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Carrasco. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Can he do it to take the lead? Now, can they take advantage? Referee has awarded a corner following that touch. <laughs> Delivering it. And in fairness, it wasn't the best of headers. Mendy. Mbappe with it. Vinicius Junior. Van Verde. Great defending. Diaz. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Brahim. Well, that was a menacing attack, but tidied up. The pie. Red to win possession back. Trying to open up the defence. Well, the supporters think it's all. Just can't get it past him. Javi Galan. And good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. Mendy. Attacking possibilities for Real. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. The pie. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. And over the byline, goal kick coming up. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches. There's 20 minutes remaining now. Eder Militao. doing well to win it back Valverde a cut back really fine play to keep possession magnificent defending Correa Riesma Atletico have given it away Superb effort to keep it in. Rodrigo. On to Valverde. Well, 
What a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Could be dangerous. They all find themselves in a position of menace. Referee spotted the little nick on the way through, so a throw in coming up. Well, Rao have had so much of the ball in the last 15 minutes and have got the ball into some really good positions. You just feel it's only a matter of time before they get their goal. Letty sloppy in possession here. Can they forge ahead? And he's struck the post. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. De Paul. And here they come now. Atletico looking for a late winner. Well, far too much elevation there. Well, he's frustrated, of course, but he knows they're now making chances. Many. Here's Valverde. Real Madrid have given us away. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. first period of extra time and it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this looking forward to it Rodrigo now with Modric now they stopped them in their tracks Koke Marcos Llorente has it oh great vision Marcos Llorente has someone to play it to. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Counter attacking chance. Carvajal. Valverde. Here's Modric. And struggling to get the shot off. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Effective piece of pressing. Getting forward. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Modric. Oh, 
Chouameni. Rodrigo. And Modric carries it forward. Let's see what he does next. And a play in a Real Madrid throw-in coming up. A promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Aurelia Chouameni. Mendy has it. Rodrigo. Can he take the chance? And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. And then it's a penalty shootout. Well, who is going to come out on top? Let's see if we find out in the second period of extra time. how to keep the opposition at bay Morata and there it breaks down but credit to the defence Real might threaten on the flank Brahim can they convert and the storm is in fabulous goal and just look at the celebration this match 3-1 to keep the ball on the part of Real time is fast running out five minutes left could reduce the deficit and in it goes and you never know in this game they might yet be able to level it
Atletico Madrid know they're not going to get too many more chances. Time is a factor. He got in the way of that cross. And a good take under duress there. And the stoppage time situation. One minute here. And there it is! Real Madrid, Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners... Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much.